Lewis Hamilton wasn't in good condition after the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. Lewis Hamilton has admitted he's dying for the day Mercedes solved their troublesome porpoising issues after enduring a worrying experience during the Azerbaijan Grand Prix. The Brit wasn't in good shape after experiencing extreme bouncing at high speeds in Baku and revealed it took him three weeks to recover after damaging his back. He added, I remember my first win at Silverstone and coming through, you know, on that rainy day coming through, I think it was Abby Chicane that we had at the time. Every time I made it through, I remember seeing the crowd stand in the rain, you know, people going off constantly in that corner. You know, we've been on an incredibly long journey together. Mercedes have been left behind by leading constructors Red Bull and Ferrari this season, with their eight-year run of dominance set to end. Both Hamilton and George Russell have suffered horrendous cases of their W13 cars bouncing at high speeds, but the former seems to have had the worst end of the stick. Hamilton finished June's race in Baku in P4 behind Max Verstappen, Sergio Perez and Russell after Ferrari pair Charles Leclerc and Sergio Perez crashed out. He looked as if he had aged 50 years as he exited his car, clearly suffering significant back pain. Ahead of Sunday's British Grand Prix, he opened up on how badly the bouncing affected him physically. He told Channel 4 that Baku was definitely a really worrying experience. Since the beginning of the year, we've experienced the car bouncing, and there have been times when it's been so heavy that you have to lift it down the straight. It's taken like three weeks to get myself to feeling great again. Hamilton has won the British Grand Prix eight times, more than any other driver in F1 history, but goes into Sunday's race as an outside favorite due to Red Bull and Ferrari's impressive packages. However, the 37-year-old is holding hope of a stunning victory. When asked whether he could oust Verstappen, Leclerc and his other rivals at Silverstone, he claimed he was dying to drive a porpoising free car again. I damn hope so, Hamilton explained. I am dying for the day we get in the car and don't have bouncing. I drove last year's car last week, and it was a dream. I got out of the car smiling ear to ear. Hamilton also remembered his past successes in the British GP, winning at Silverstone for the first time in F1 in 2008. He hasn't made his admiration for the UK crowd private over the weekend, and he took the opportunity to laud those present again.